Hey everybody, how's everybody doing? It's your girl Emma, and I'm back with a, a cooking blog. <laughs> with a cooking blog. So how's everybody? Everybody's good? Good. So listen, y'all, I'm just here real quick. This video ain't gonna be long. I'm here to make my um, chicken tacos and nachos. Okay, so this is the chicken that I got from the food pantry. Okay, this is what this is. Y'all, this chicken type of chicken does not make a lot of grease and I don't want it sticking. So I put a little oil in there with some minced garlic. Dang, I meant to put my onion in there first. Dang. I meant to put them onions in there, y'all. Let me go and throw them in there now. I meant to put the onions in there with that garlic. Dang. Y'all threw me off. See what y'all did? Y'all threw me off. Yeah, so I'm going to make uh, some nachos with chicken. Y'all forgive me. I'm not on camera today because the girl is tired and I didn't feel like putting no clothes on. So I got my, my duster on. My granny duster. So if y'all see it a little bit, that's what that is. That's my granny duster. So I'm going to put a little pepper in here. You know, I don't know. I must be buying the cheap pepper. She can't even taste the pepper when I put pepper in, in my food. Unless I'm not putting enough. And I know it'll be looking like I'll be putting a whole lot. But you can't taste it. You can't taste it. That's what that is, y'all. Yeah. You cannot taste it at all. Well, I'm putting the garlic in it. I got garlic in it. All right. <clears throat> Some of that. All right. At first, I was <coughs> I was going to make this video with music. And then I changed my mind. Maybe I still will make it with music and talk over it. talk over it. Maybe I can add a little bit of music. I don't know, child. <laughs> I don't know. So this is the chicken that I got from the uh, food pantry, y'all. Uh, and I'm making nachos. I'm gonna make some tacos with this, too. Matter of fact, let me get my... I'm gonna show you how I make my Tacos and nachos. Well, I do have nacho shells. <laughs> oh, I tell you, every time I use seasoning, I start to season. Let me show you. I'm going to put a little oil in here. I'm going to turn on this back burner if I can speed up the process a little bit. This is how I make my um, taco shells. This is how I make my taco shells. Okay. Okay, this is the white tortilla. Okay. I'm gonna use that. Y'all look. Remember those beets that I got? Remember those beets? I just cooked these beets. I put put them in water, cut them up. And I put a little sugar in there. I just cooked them. These beets. I'm going to eat these beets. Okay. I'm going to have to drain some of this off, I see. So this is the chicken that I got. Okay. That's not done yet now. But I'm gonna fry my um my taco shells. I'm gonna make one flat and I'm gonna make a taco. With it. Okay. 
didn't like the great big chunks. I kind of like for it to be like round B. I guess I didn't crumble it up enough. Okay. Now my nose is running. Alright, so I'm going to put this over here. This is my oil in here. Yeah, I think I got a little too much oil in there. But this is how I make my um, my homemade tacos. In this ground ground chicken, I'm going to put a can of uh, refried beans in here too. Okay. Uh, yeah, I got too much grease in there. I got way too much grease in there. I got way too much grease in there, y'all. Yeah, I don't know if I had that much grease in there when I'm doing my making my um, homemade tacos. This tastes really, really, really good. Maybe I can see both at the same time. Okay. All right, I was gonna pull some of this oil out of here, but I'm not because it's cooking out by itself. What? It's good, real good. Now right, this is the refried beans. Muscles. Okay, now you see that? Now what I do is I fold it over. Let me take this on out of here. Put another one in there, but I'm going to show you all. Just give me one minute and get this together. And this is refried beans with the chicken and onion and garlic. Okay, so I just folded up the tortilla like this, and then you put your fillings in it. So, yeah. Now, I don't have any tomatoes, but I do have some uh, taco sauce. Now, I'm going to make a flat, a flat one, too. A taco and a flat one. Okay? refried beans with chicken, ground chicken, onion, and mixed garlic. This is what this is. Okay? Now, like I said, this is not going to be a long video. This is going to be real quick and short. Because your girl tired. We're going to go to bed. And it's about 5.19 in the evening. I'll show you all the clock. This is really good. This is my first time ha making it with chicken. I'm so used to making it with the ground beef. But this time I actually made it with the chicken. It tastes really, 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 really good. Really, really, really good. Alright, so. Got that ready. Alright, that's turned off. Okay. 
Okay. I'm going to put a twist on it, y'all. I'm going to use uh, Some, uh, that's hot. There go my nose running. Oh, again, every time I cook, y'all, my nose run. Okay, so you see how that flat? Woo. How they look. Okay. okay, now I'm going to put this together right quick. This is the flat one. This is ground chicken with refried beans. Now this here would be enough, but like I said, uh, I know I'm not going to eat the taco in the in the taco uh, pizza. That's my refried beans. my salsa salsa on there and my cheese two types of cheeses y'all in the microwave for a few minutes. I know I should have heated this up. I know. But I didn't. Put that in the microwave, okay? Now, I do have lettuce, but I think I'm going to use spinach this time, y'all. Put some spinach on top of that. This is the spinach that I got from the um, food pantry, okay? And there you have it. That's it. This is what your girl is going to have for dinner today. Okay? Seems like I'm miss all oh, jalapeno peppers. Hold up, y'all. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it.
All right, y'all. This is to finish the touch. I forgot my peppers. I forgot. These are peppers. I'm trying to put these peppers on there. I can't even see it. I know I'm fixing this on the stove because I don't want to be bothered with this camera, y'all. That's why I got this on the stove. All right. Now this here was a a jalapeno jalapeno. But what I did was I cut it up. Now y'all, I'm gonna take some of this juice. I'll put some of that juice in there because I love jalapenos. Okay, and this is it. Okay, all right, y'all. That's the my taco pizza, homemade. And normally, what I would do with this. I would just put some of this in here and put everything that you saw on that. I will put that on here, but I'm not going to do that. Okay. All right, y'all. Until next time, I'll see everybody on the next video. On the next video. And that's my um, taco pizza. And I'm going to have some of these beets with that. Okay, y'all. I'll see everybody tomorrow. <laughs> okay, I know I look a mess. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye. Smooches to everybody. All right, bye.